After a tough loss to the Nazareth Blue Eagles just one week prior, the Golden Hawks were in need of a bounce back win. But the Hurricanes of Liberty, who had just recorded their first victory of the season, would make Becca High earn it. The Canes were the first on the board thanks to a 31 yard field goal from Connor McLaughlin, and those were actually the only points of the first quarter. Becca High's first score didn't come until the start of the second when Ramel Terry finished a crisp 11-play drive for the Hawks with a tutty, but the extra point was no good, so Bethlehem Catholic only held a three-point edge. Not to worry, though, a second long and effective drive would help the Hawks extend their lead shortly after. Senior QB Luke Thomas punched in another short touchdown run at the end of an eight-play drive to put the Hawks up nine. But before the break, Liberty's Nico Sicaria would make a momentum-shifting interception that the Canes turned into three points thanks to a second 30-yard field goal from McLaughlin to cut Becca High's lead to just six. Coming out of the break, Liberty continued to make things happen. An early fumble recovery for the Hurricanes helped them take their first lead since the first quarter after Jaden Rosado ran in a 27-yard touchdown. And that was just the beginning of the second half madness. In those two quarters alone, Liberty and Becca High would exchange the lead four different times. Fast forward to the fourth quarter with 8.52 on the clock and we'd see Rosado found the gap again for a three-yard finish and a 1918 Liberty lead. But Becca High was ready to answer. Third down, nine to go. Thomas finds Eric Wirt for a 47-yard game. That would help them big time as they eventually reached the Liberty one-yard line. Thomas with the keeper put the Hawks up 24-19 and that was the final score. Wart finished with 154 receiving yards while Thomas put on a show, throwing for 233 in the air. It's always a big game. Um, it comes down to the city, who wants the city the most. This game certainly did not come without some serious adversity for the Golden Hawks, but proving to themselves that they can fight through those tough moments made the victory that much sweeter. It showed how much heart our players had and how much love we have for this game. We didn't give up on each other. We showed no, no doubt in each other, and we just kept it moving. I mean, last year we, were, we went 2-7. and seven. I mean, that 3-1, that and one, baby, that really helped us. We just got to fight back and keep playing as a team. Don't argue. Just play as one. From BASD Stadium, for the Service Electric Network, I'm Courtney DuPont.